Okay, in this example, I've made a temperature controlled fan for us to give a try. And what you're going to notice here, we have a few different components. Uh, first off, we have our micro bit. And you'll see on the micro bit board it says heat on. You'll see that our servo, our continuous servo motor is spinning. And we have a green light on. We also then have a red pin light that is off. So essentially what's going on here, we are saying that um, when the heat is on, which I have, it's set at 30 degrees Celsius, which means that it's about uh, 80 degrees. Uh, so if it's less than 80 degrees, the heat will be on representing the servo motor and the green light is on saying that, hey, the heat is on. If let's say if the heat rose in the classroom here to above 80 degrees, our LED board would then say heat off. The motor would stop, the green light would turn off, and then the red light would then turn on, saying that the heat is now off. You'll see how I have this wired. So for our servo motor, you're gonna notice uh, your servo motor, we had to put some extension alligator clips on there. So what we have here, we have uh, the yellow alligator clip going, uh, coming from the servo motor is going to pin zero. The red alligator clip from the servo motor is going to your three volt. And then the black alligator clip coming from the servo motor is going to the ground. For our green light, I tried to uh, color code these. So the green power is going to pin one. The white ground from the green light is going to our ground. And I just have that piggybacked on there. And then for our red light, I have the red power going to pin two, and then the ground going to obviously the ground on the end. So that's what it'll look like and that should work. Um, and hopefully you enjoyed this video and hopefully it helps you out here a little bit to get our temperature controlled fan to work. Best of luck.